Do you have cervical cancer? Absolutely. Okay. And when were you diagnosed with cervical cancer? They tried to diagnose me when I was pregnant with my youngest daughter, and I said no because I had just lost a baby before that, and I wasn't going to lose another child. And so when I went back in after having my daughter for my six-week checkup, they proceeded to do all of the testing and all of that, and I found out six weeks after my daughter was born. Okay. And, and what treatment did you get for it? I opted out because I, I had to be a mom to my three kids. I, they don't really, my, my youngest daughter's dad isn't around. So, so I, is the cancer growing? Is it, did it opt out with you? What happened? I, I, <laughs> I've just chosen not to know. I'm just trying to live my life. I, I don't want to. I, so do you go to the doctor, you know, once a year for an exam? Um, not really, I guess. I, I, I used to up until we got so busy with our lives and the construction business that Tanessa wanted to start. Mm -hmm. and I've known a lot of people with cancer, <laughs> many who have died. I've never known anyone who's just opted out of treatment and nothing happened.